my name's Wendy Jennings, and I'm also known as the Coddy Womble Lady. I'm an author, Reiki practitioner, and a life coach. And what I aim to do is I work with people who are feeling lost, they're feeling as though they want something else more in their life. They've, they've got an idea about what maybe they would like to do, what they would, where they would like to be. They don't quite have the confidence or the, the clarity to be able to get from where they are now to where they want to be. I personally have had my own experiences with things to doing things like this. I went through loss, deep loss in 2012 when I lost both my parents to cancer. And it was all very quickly. It was all within five weeks of each other. And the whole journey itself took nine months. So beginning of the 2012, I had two happy, healthy parents. By September 2012, they've both gone. And me being an only child, and I was 43, but an only child. Dad did say that I was going to be an orphan by the time I was 43, but did make me chuckle at the time. Um, but yeah, basically, it, I didn't know where I was going to go. I didn't know what I wanted to do. I, I'd lost my identity in life. I, I didn't felt as I didn't have a purpose anymore. I wasn't a daughter, not a sibling. And I, at that point, I wasn't in a relationship either. So, yeah, I didn't quite know what I wanted to do. But over time, and taking time out just to work on myself and to be to get to know myself again to find out who Wendy was I decided I would go traveling and I took myself off to Bali and Australia it was one of those again that was one of those light bulb moments it was in the middle of the night and it was told to go back to Australia I've been there before it wasn't a complete bolt out the blue <laughs> I've got family there so it made perfect, perfect sense and while I did this, I kept a blog of what was, a, a, like, more like a blog, I kept a diary to start with of what was going on in my journey and just to keep in touch with friends and family back home. And what became quite apparent as I was traveling around was <laughs> I quite liked writing and I actually became quite good at it. So when I came back, I got persuaded to turn my blog into a book and that's where my book from cancer to Cody Wample was born that is my story of finding my life after loss and that has now led me on to that led me into life coaching I'm now a qualified life coach because what I want to do is to be there to support other people that are struggling with loss of any kind because loss doesn't necessarily mean bereavement loss can be all sorts of things. It can be a loss of a job, it could be loss of a pet, it could be loss of a home. You know, if you have to up sticks and you move, move somewhere else and you've lost your network of friends, you've, you've lost your social life, it leaves you a little bit feeling a bit discombobulated. That's another one of my favourite words. I'll explain Coddy Wampin in a minute, but I love discombobulated as well. <laughs> um, and yeah, and, and it just just sometimes need that sounding board to talk, talk things out with. So that's where I found life coaching came in. I was getting people that have read the book from Cancer to Cody Womble was coming to me for support. So I decided that I was going to, to become a life coach to be able to give them more support and lead them down the paths that they could see for themselves but didn't quite know how to go about things. So when people do work with me, they, they, they do gain, gain clarity, they do gain the confidence and they feel, empower, they feel empowered. I've had that said to me quite a few times, the people that have worked with me, they just feel they've got that oomph and that impetus to, to get going and take their, take their steps forward. And as I say, when they're sitting in front of me on the screen or face to face, and I see these light bulb moments go off in their faces. It's just, oh, just gives me a warm fuzzies basically <laughs> um and the, oh, I love to see it further down when I see the posts on their social media or something like that and they say I get little messages you know, thanks Wendy you, you helped me do this 
I mean, I've worked with a couple of people that one lady, she ended up referring both her sons to me as well because they were feeling a bit lost. They, they were in their 20s and they just, just didn't quite know where they wanted to be or what they wanted to do. So, yeah, I'd helped, helped her and she referred her sons and she said now that they're pretty much sorted and they're quite happy with their career choices and what they want to do. And she's gone off from strength to strength. She's set up Facebook groups. She's set up her own business. She's just doing, she's becoming more visible with her business and she's gaining more traction with her business. So to me, that's just, that's just wonderful to see. Um, that's, that's just great. And another lady, she came to me, she booked six sessions with me. And originally she came to me because she, she felt she wanted a partner in her life. That was the only thing that was missing in her life was having a partner. She wanted a man in her life. And as the system sessions progressed, she discovered that it, it wasn't she needed a man in her life. She just wanted to feel more fulfilled with her life. She wanted to have more going on with her life rather than just work. And as we progressed, she discovered that she she enjoyed painting. She she loved artwork. You know, she produces beautiful artwork. She never thought she never thought she could do that. Um, and as she she enjoys going out to the theatre. Obviously, at the moment, when I recorded this, we had the pandemic, so it wasn't she couldn't always do that. But she, she enjoys getting out with her friends. She just wants to be out with her friends and just enjoying her life and. She doesn't, she's realised that she doesn't need a man to do that. She can, she can do that quite easily. <laughs> so, yeah, she came away and she said, well, she said, oh, I'm just so, I just feel such, in such a better place now of where I was. I'm more confident and much happier to where I want to be. So people I tend to work with are normally around from 40s, male and female, um, usually people with 40s, 50s. As I say, that they're sort of in this, maybe their second phase of life, if you like. They kind of, um, sort of just they've had the kids, and maybe they just want to know they want to spend some time on themselves, but they don't cre they don't really know what it is that they want to do. So that's when they'll come to me. So basically, what do I offer? Well, originally, initially, I invite anybody to have a thirty minute discovery call with me that's completely free and there's no obligation with that and that just takes that's just a little bit of an interpo informal get to know you you get to know me and we'll work out a package for you I offer a different uh, op options for you there's there's a 30 minute what I call a breakthrough blitz if you just want to have a quick brainstorm there's a one hour deep dive session where it just takes that little bit further and get to Again, it does, it's straight in there with the nitty gritty, get down and dirty, if you like, for an hour. If there's more that you want to discover, then there's, a, uh, the, there's my three sessions, and they're usually about an hour each. And then there's also another package of six sessions, usually, again, about an hour each. And that's, they're backed up by email, as, email support as well. They, I would suggest for those weekly weekly a week apart or maybe fortnightly certainly no more than fortnightly it's easy to forget what where you are and can stay on track with that so yeah i would recommend that they're weekly or fortnightly um but yeah i'll go through all of that more in more detail with you if that's the direction you'd like to go in um i, I do this because it's not just about sitting there and going to work it's not just going to work for me it's, I want to be make, helping as many people as possible feel better about themselves and feeling more fulfilled, fulfilled and happier and just living that happy joyful everybody deserves to be joyful everybody deserves joy you can be go through as much crap in your life but you still deserve to be have joy in your life and I aim 
to spread as much joy in this world as I possibly can. <laughs> my big why, I suppose, of why I do this for myself is because when I was going through my stuff with mum and dad and they were sick, we looked after by a fabulous hospice down in Sussex called St Barnabas House. And I just want to be able to give back. So proceeds from my sales of um, from cancer to Cody Wample, they go to the hospice. And anything else I can give to any other hospice along the way is always going to be a bonus. And now you're probably sitting there thinking, what the hell does Coddy Wample mean? <laughs> well, Coddy Wample means to travel in a purposeful direction towards a vague destination. And I think that's just something that we all do to a certain extent, I think. It came to me when I was traveling, my friend found it and just said, Wendy, this is just such your word. This is just so you. And it kind of stuck. <laughs> and that's why I'm known as the Coddy Wample Lady because wherever I go, it's, oh yeah, you're the Coddy Wample Lady. And it's, I've kind of adopted it now. And I, it's just such a joyful word. And it is something that we all do. And it, it sums me up because we are all on a purpose. And I do sit on a journey rather. And I do see life as a journey and I can see where I, I get this intuitive feeling of where you are in your life and where you want to be. And I can help you guide that. I can kind of help to guide you there on your purposeful direction <laughs> towards your vague destination. You may have a perfect idea of what your destination will be. There's usually some di diversions going off as well. So, yeah. That's basically what I do. And coaching sessions with me start off very gently. I get, if you, I get you to ground so there's a bit of breathing, just to center yourself and spend some time on you. Because self-care is so important. And if you're working from a glass that's half full, then or not half full. If you're if you think you're working from a glass that's half empty. It, that you, how, how can you help other be there to support others? So it's vitally important that, I, that you ground yourself, and this is your time. Your time with me is your time to be able to spend time on yourself to help you grow to where you want to be. So I use general, gentle questioning, general, gentle coaxing to find out what it, what it is that's making you tick, and find out how where you want to be and what you want to do. So by the time you finish your sessions with me, you will feel empowered, you will have clarity, and you'll be off Coddy Wampling. <laughs> you'll be joining the Coddy Wample community. <laughs> so, and if this feels good to you, then I can be found via my website, thecoddywamplelady.com. I'm on Facebook as the Coddy Wample Lady, and I'm on Instagram, or email me via. Hello at the Cordy Wample Lady.com. <laughs>